Uh, the, the orange men were out today, Scotty. The orange men were out today. 12th of August. They were. They were, well, I was up seeing my grandmother and I heard them in the distance. Aha. Uh -huh. How very strange. Yep. There's Daniel who says he's the Grand Wizard. Yeah. Isn't that wonderful? They were, they were out today and I was in the Belfast City Centre today, Scotty. Were you ever in the city centre of Belfast? No. You see, I didn't actually get to the city centre and I must come over. What I think I'll do, Tom, is maybe it's about 80 miles to Stranra. And I think and maybe I'll just travel down and come over and just do a weekend in Belfast. I remember when I went to um, Scotland most recently. I went to a dock. Uh, uh -huh. I got on at um, I got on at the Belfast docks and took the cruise. And I brought me over to a place. Was it Cairn Ryan? Cairn Ryan. Yes, absolutely. That's that's where you would land. That's near Stranra. Yeah, and then we took the bus over through Air, and then we went, we went to Edinburgh, and then in the spent a while in Edinburgh, and then went into Glasgow. Isn't that lovely? Oh, listen, Tom, you're on a winner there. I can't tell you. I would like to see the Titanic experience. Yeah, yeah, it's it's good. I've seen it before myself. You know, um, they have a remodel of the Titanic down there. It's it's only a wee small one, obviously, but uh -huh. you know, it's it's it'd be interesting if you haven't been there before. You oh, know. Yes. Well, you see, I find about, all things interesting, Tom. That part of Belfast is nice. You know, t you get the train over to a train station called. Titanic Quarter. Ah, right. So it's actually got its own station. Yeah, but it's it's only a, it's not a station. It's only a wee stop, you know. Um, the train service over here is quite good, you know. You've got a train station called uh, Belfast Lanyon Place. Right. Used to be called Belfast. Used to be called Belfast Central. Aha. Uh -huh. And that is the hub for the Enterprise, the cross border train. Wow. So. And then you have another station, which you're, you probably know yourself. Well, maybe you do, maybe you don't. Great Victoria Street. Aha! Uh -huh. Have right. you ever heard of it? Yes, I have heard of Great Victoria Street, although I haven't seen it yet. And that's the base of operations for all the trains in the north. Wonderful. Right. I'm going to come um, and see all this, Tom. This is wonderful. They're talking about doing a new line that goes from a town called Portadown. Portadown. I've heard to, of Portadown, yep. Yeah. To Derry, port it down to Derry. So that will be by the sea, and you would get right down to Derry from there. Yeah, and it's going to go through Tyrone in a town called Oma. Yes, Oma, yes, absolutely, yes, who had some serious problems in their day. But uh, but it that's did, wonderful, right? yes. The Oma, the, and, the Oma uh, bombing, yes. There was an old line that closed in 2003, 20 years ago now, Scotty. It ran from a town called Lisburn. Lisbon, I've yeah, heard of Lisbon as well. Yeah. Crumlin. Yes, Crumlin. Crumlin as the Crumlin Road. That line has been abandoned for the past twenty years, Scotty. Uh huh. But the old the old tracks are still there. Ah. So what they're gonna do now is they're gonna redirect the line, still bring it through Crumlin, but they'll bring it to Belfast International Airport. Wow. To George Best. And then They'll have another one to George Best. So if you ever come over in the near future, it'll probably take them a right while to do it. But um, it'll be handy for people getting the train from George Best to Belfast, you know. Tom, can but I George give George Best you... already has a train line. It's got a train line there from the centre of the, the city. Yeah. What yeah. were you going to say, Scotty? I was, no, I was just going to tell you a snippet of interesting information. I used to share an agent with George Best. You used to share an agent? Yes, my agent was George Best's agent. How about that? What is agent? an agent? I, I remember really too well in that. Oh, an agent? Well, somebody that actually has got the ear to the ground and knows where the, the broadcasting and the personal appearance oh, work is. Oh, yes. Yes, oh, sure, I know what an agent is, surely. There you are. Yes, yes. yeah. So, so there you are. Tom, lovely sure, to George hear you. Go on, sir. You shared George Best. Is, that, that's something right enough. And was he talking to you about him? Oh, yes, absolutely. You'll hear it. If you go on to YouTube and put into yep. YouTube, Scotty McClue talks to Bill McMurdo. Bill, Mc, Bill McMurdo? Bill McMurdo, yes. You pop that in. 
And uh, I'll do it and I'll have, uh, a, I'll have a good watch. You'll out. have a great, great time listening to that. It's a radio interview, so it's audio, but it's it'll give you all the background. The time the Beatles were around, George was at his height, everything. Yeah, I'll definitely watch it, Scotty. Fantastic. Tom, lovely to hear you, and I'll say to you, dinky do, sir. Dinky do, Scotty. Dinky do. Dinky do, bless you. What a fine fellow. That's our Tom in Belfast there.